Hi, this is Tom Essay from Money and Markets TV. After an extremely turbulent 2011, Europe has been relatively quiet over the holiday season. But now things are starting to heat up again. This week brings high-level summits attended by German Chancellor Angela Merkel, French President Nicolas Sarkozy, and new Italian Prime Minister Mario Monti. Plus, we have a meeting of the European Central Bank. These developments are not giving us anything new to report, just the same old tired rhetoric about enacting measures to fight the sovereign debt crisis and stimulate the Eurozone economy. However, despite the lack of concrete action, the Leaders' Summit and ECB meetings are likely to result in more headline watching and wild market swings, just as they did during the fourth quarter of last year. With that context in mind, our challenge as investors is to discern which headlines are material to the direction of the market and which are simply not very important. There was a time when we could rely on the market itself to tell us which headlines were meaningful. But as last year showed, this market is simply too volatile to be reliable as a strong, shorter-term indicator. Instead, I suggest you keep an eye on the Stocks Europe 600 Bank Index, symbol SX7P. This index has been a solid leading indicator for the overall market since last summer because European banks are now the leading edge of the crisis. Not just the expanding banking crisis, but also the sovereign debt crisis. Investors understand that if a sovereign like Greece defaults, it would hurt European banks the most. Since June 30th of last year, the Stocks Europe 600 Bank Index has tumbled 32%. And its recent warnings have been even more ominous. It's already down more than 6% so far in 2012. Unlike the schizophrenic broad markets, which rally sharply on one headline and crash on another, this index will provide insight into the true state and direction of the Eurozone crisis. It can also help you look beyond short-term market act action and the latest headlines and allow you to better time your trading and investing decisions. I'm Tom Essay for Money and Markets TV and thanks for watching.